Egg on my face. Uh, playing uh, Councilman uh, Jenkins, I believe, was the my my character's name there on the hit series SWAT. Uh, I get asked a lot from people, what's it like working on a hit TV show? What's it like working with, you know, uh, popular actors, famous actors, Academy Award winning actors? I've done a lot of that. I've been real lucky in my career. And so uh, I'm doing a little more storytelling these days about what it's like behind the scenes. I've been asked a lot about that. And so I'm going to uh, give you guys uh, a little bit more of that. Uh, this was from the hit TV show SWAT where I played Councilman Jenkins and I get hit in the face with an egg and a lot of people want to know, gosh, uh, how was that? Um, what was it like working with those guys? And so uh, we're going to talk about all of that. Uh, before we do, I just want to let you know also that I do private coaching. Yes, indeed. I am doing private coaching here in 2022 and so uh, the links are down below. So you will see my links for uh, private coaching. Also, if you are looking for an agent, I have a fantastic um, introduction to an agent letter. It's in the form of a PDF and it's, it's really fantastic and it can help you get an agent which can change the trajectory of your career. Uh, if you just click the link there, uh, it will take you to the, uh, the PDF on uh, the introduction letter to an agent. So let's get to the nuts and bolts of this. This was a this was a it was a super fun shoot. Um, I worked with uh, Alex Russell and um, Jay Harrington, who play uh, Street and Deacon. Uh, I believe their names are on the show. Uh, super nice guys. They did some uh, behind the scenes footage, which I'm going to show you here in a second. And uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. So one of the questions is. How many takes did it take to uh, actually get hit in the face correctly with the egg? Because you know you got a guy throwing an egg off 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 camera off screen, and so you know they're not always going to do the right thing. So I'm going to show you some behind the scenes footage and some other stuff that's pretty funny. Uh, they threw fake eggs first just to practice. Um, the guy who was uh, playing the guy who actually threw the egg. I think they were going to have, he was an actor, and they were going to have him throw the egg. They gave him a couple tries with a fake egg and decided that's not going to work. So a little behind the scenes uh, TV magic, what they did was they, um, they got a guy who cheated up. And cheated up means they got right next to, right behind the camera there, and threw an egg much, much closer than the guy was, you know, who was standing back there, who was playing the guy who threw the egg. So <clears throat> they cheated it a little bit. Uh, it still took the guy two or three practice tries, and you'll see on one of the behind the scenes videos that I'm gonna show you here in a second that, um, <laughs> that they missed the guy. The guy was, I had a stand in, and they missed the guy like about this right over his head. Um, and so then I stepped in, and then uh, it took them four tries. So here's what happens when it comes to uh, TV shows like that, and when you have. A stunt, they consider it a stunt where you're throwing an egg or something happens where your wardrobe is going to get messed up. So they had, uh, I think, six different, six pairs of shirt, six shirts uh, and six ties. Uh, I think they had three jackets. They had a, a bunch of duplicates of the suit I was wearing, suffice to say, because if I got hit just a little bit and the hit wasn't that great, then a yoke got on my tie or my shirt. Then they had to change. They had to cut and ch and I had to go to wardrobe and they had to change me, and it was a, a whole thing. So needless to say, they want to get it right on the very first try. So uh, they missed me completely the first time. Went right over my head. Uh, the second time it grazed my hair, didn't break, broke behind me. Uh, third time it ticked my uh, forehead a little bit. Little yoke, I think, I think I only had to change my jacket on that one. And then the fourth time was the charm, crack right in the face. Um, and uh, uh, Alex Russell, who plays uh, uh, Deke, no, Street, he was there, and you'll see <laughs> behind the scenes, he was filming it, and he was kind enough to uh, airdrop it to me so I could show it to you guys. But uh, they put it on social media, and it was uh, it was pretty funny. So the process was um, 
fairly simple and fairly normal as far as, as getting the part. Um, uh, it was back when the auditions were in person and not uh, sending them on tape uh, via the internet. So I went into the room, I auditioned for it. Uh, I think, I want to say they booked me off the first audition. They started doing that a little bit in 2018, a lot more in 2019, um, where you would go in for the audition and instead of having a callback, which is, you know, another audition where, you know, 40 people go in for the audition and they like eight of the 40 people, they'll bring those eight guys or girls back in for what they call a callback. And you can, I have a callback video here somewhere. You can find that. Um, and so instead of having a callback, they, I think they just booked me right off the audition, which is, which is more and more common. They just, they decide they're like, we don't need to bring these guys back in. It costs more money. Anyhow. Uh, so I booked the job. Um, I had to read this part. I had a little a part that I was supposed to read. I was playing a councilman and there was a angry sort of protest behind me. One guy's yelling at me, throws an egg. The cops come in, arrest this guy. I tell him not to arrest him. There's egg all over my face. I'll show you all that too. Uh, so it was, uh, it was really fantastic. It was really nice working on the set of SWAT and uh, the guys couldn't be nicer. Uh, one of my buddies, uh, Brian O'Black, was playing one of the sheriffs, and, and he's he's in the clip also. So it was it was pretty great. So four tries, egg on the face, super fun day. Um, you know, if, if you've been an actor or you're working as an actor or you want to be an actor, I, I just have to say it's just one of the best. It's one of the best jobs ever. Um, uh, you, every day on the set is just a... It's just such a fantastic experience. And so um, they're sometimes few and far between, but you just have to stay the course. You have to continue to be persistent. And, you know, I, I've used this analogy before. If, if you're a golfer uh, or if you, if you do anything that you like to do and you're not very good at it, and like for golf, for me, is I will go golfing and I'll play not very good almost all day, and then I'll hit a great drive or I'll sink a great putt. And it's what keeps you coming back. And as far as the acting goes, to bring that around to this scenario, um, this example, it's it's days like this on SWAT that keep you coming back because it was just so much fun. Uh, they gave me a really hard time about uh, getting hit with the egg. It was super funny, and everyone couldn't be nicer. And so you have days like that on the set, and you just go, God, this is what a great what a great career. Anyway, so. Listen, uh, if you have any questions about my my day on the set uh, with the boys at SWAT, uh, leave them in the questions and comments section down below. Uh, don't forget to like this video if you got anything out of it. Share it with your friends. Tell everyone. Let me know what you think of my new... I'm trying new stuff. So this is a new backdrop, new lighting. I'm going to do new and different stuff. I'm going to do more tutorials. I'm going to tell more stories. I'm going to do all kinds of stuff. So... If you have questions or comments about any of that, leave them in the questions and comments section down below. Like and share. If you have not subscribed to my channel, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, yeah, so uh, like, subscribe, do all the all the stuff and all the things. And here's the, here's the other thing, is you're never gonna believe me again because uh, I told you last week I was gonna do a uh, who said that. And I didn't, I don't have one. I don't have one again. Turns out I'm busy doing stuff. I just booked another show that I will be telling you about soon. Uh, it shoots on Friday. It is a television show, uh, and I will give you all the details soon. Um, let's see. I guess that's it. All right. I will see you guys next week on another episode of... Yeah, like when the camera the glass is yeah. 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 And, that, and after he's like, fuck, oh, we're reacting to it. We're, you're going to back up, and then this happened very quickly. The camera's getting into position to the wider spot, and we just say, egg, again. And you act like you just got hit, and everything continues. Okay. So we're just getting a nice safety shot of the egg smash. Then we very quickly, while egg's still on him, back up and pretend he got hit again. Okay. And it continues to the end. Someone will say egg, and then I react again. Yeah. All right, here it goes. And then what is the cue line for the egg to be thrown? Yeah. 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 Okay, great. Right. Oh, so, okay.
action. Yeah, you got it right. Uh, here till Thursday. Try the veal. Action. Social media takeover? Yeah. But this filming of the egg suddenly seems really mean. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah, I know it's... <laughs> this feels mean. It does. <laughs> I'm trying to, like, good stuff for the social. I'll see if he's got Instagram and I'll airdrop it to him. Most embarrassing <laughs> moment of this. <laughs> yeah. Uno mas.